Hello, welcome to my channel. Today, I want to make a very simple, basic potato curry. Over here, you can see I uh, cut uh, five, five uh, potatoes, that which was a, a kilo. Okay, I cut it in uh, quite a big uh, cube because we actually want to eat the potatoes. And then for the braising, I have half a cup of oil. I cut a small, I sliced a small onion and just a few curry leaf. And then I have one very small tomato. And then I have a, a tablespoon of heaped uh, mixed masala and a teaspoon of heaped uh, hardi to color it up and a teaspoon of rough salt, but you can add salt per your taste. And for the garnishing, I have fresh dhania. Okay, I have my pot on moderate heat, and uh, I'm gonna put in my oil first. Allow this to heat up. Whenever you're using potatoes, must always have it kept in water till you use. Firstly, I put in my onions. And allow these onions to get wet. And then I decrease my heat. While the onions are getting ready, I throw in my curry leaf. Okay, my onions are done. Now I will actually add in my masala to cooking. Now I'm going to add in my potatoes. I stir it well till the masala is coated. I will allow you to fry for about 10 minutes, but I'll keep watching. Okay, 10 minutes has passed us, and you can see the potatoes are fried in beautiful with the masala. And now I'm gonna Add in my salt. And my tomatoes. As you can see, I'm not using much of the ingredients to overpower the potato. I allow this to cook for another 10 minutes till the tomatoes cook out. And then actually I'll actually add in a cup of water and bring it to the boil till it thickens and the curry is already done. Okay, 10 minutes has passed us. The tomatoes has cooked. Now I'm going to add in my cup of water and I'll increase my heat and let this two come to the boil. But I will see whether I need more water. 
because I need the potatoes to soften up. Okay, as you can see my one cup of water has boiled away and because we are in Joburg, we have this problem with having hard water. But if you're in Durban, most likely you can just use a cup of water and your potatoes will be done. And thereafter, I'm actually going to use another cup of water and allow it to boil out because we want a thick potato curry. I will allow this to boil and see how soft our potatoes has gone. Okay, now we're going to check up on our potatoes. It's looking nice. Nice and done with some thick gravy. If you feel your gravy is not thick enough and you like it thick, you can actually like smash a potato or two and it will give it a thick finish. So now I'm going to actually garnish with my garnier and put my stove off. It's ready for serving. A simple potato curry. Here you go, your lovely basic potato curry served with some lovely rice. In fact, it can actually be made into roti rolls, especially when you're traveling somewhere. It makes lovely roti rolls for the road. And I've got some nice mixed veg to accompany uh, the food today. In fact, this is the next batch of mixed veg pickle that I made. Uh, you must enjoy and thank you all for watching.